Uh, watch out, there's a bunch of Sphinx now. Just, just Shinx, not Sphinx. There we go. I don't think there's a Sphinx Pokemon yet. They're just a kitty, though. Oh no, I was thinking um, Egyptian Sphinx. Oh. Yes. Was I in your way? I'm sorry. Oh yes. Like I'll try to talk to the nurse, and then I end, end up accidentally talking to the uh, the TM machine. <laughs> The technical machine machine. <laughs> That's what they named it. <laughs> yes. The automatic teller machine. You're the far future. Uh, yeah. But, uh, this far future um, Pokemon. Is that a crystal or is that just. Yes, it's called Claw. We're looking for a Titan version of those. Are you fighting. Oh. Oh, did you run over a rickety? Oh, I haven't seen one of those before! Oh my gosh, it is the tiniest! <laughs> nimble. Like it's a nimble thimble. It's just a thimble full of bug. Is that also? Oh, that's a gimme ghoul. Finally figured out how to interact with the gimme ghoul. They just give you coins, but I caught a, a gimme ghoul uh, in a treasure chest, so I can evolve that when I have enough gimme ghoul coins. Tiniest Pokeball now. Okay, I I, I see another terror raid down here. Oh, it started raining. Is this my crystal? Oh, it is my crystal. Okay. Ooh, it's a ghost type for baby. Um. Let's get it dark type. Let's see. Yeah, I, um. Alright, go ahead and push the Y button so you can join me. Just poison. Okay. So the Shirtle's like the first Pokemon I've ever looked at and like, that's not a Pokemon. <laughs> so how do you Oh, uh, you might have to look at their stats with the plus button. to settle for a ghost type. I think ghost type is also um, weak to ghost type, as weird as that is. I've got a 
Uh, yeah, that one. Well, it's, it's not dark as an evil, but like the dark type evolution, it just evolves at night. While the psychic type evolves during the day. Uh. Okay, cause it would just say dark type. Just like poison type or fairy type. Um, you might just have to go ahead and go because we got twenty seconds left. You've been doing good with quackers. Okay. So just say A. Yeah, all ready to go. Pokemon can draw forth the power hidden within blooming wildflowers. It is particularly fond of red flowers. At least this one is. Should we just add that to our party? Only if you want to. I well, mean, that way if we run into another dark Pokemon, we have 
Yeah. But she is she a she's a fairy, so I already have a fairy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, her terror type's just ghosts. Okay. Let me look up. Red flower names. Oh, cool. You can evolve Pokemon like Jigglypuff and Clefairy with that. Okay. Hibis. Gus, yeah. Okay. Hibiscus is in the box. That was fun. Okay, let's see if we can get actually get to town now and do the. Oh! I were handed to the Mario Mushroom. This is very salty and angry. <laughs> By which I mean it's a Pokemon that's made of salt. I mean its name is actually Knuckle. N A C L, so you have to figure out how to pronounce it. There's a cute little rock, Ralph. Oh, thank you for the ingredients. How do you get the ingredients? I just talked to the dude. Totally unrelated, but I heard there's a cliff face near here that moves. Wonder if that's true. You should take a breather here and get ready so you don't get too surprised by any moving rolls. Ah, that's the Titan we need to fight. I wonder if you can collect, c uh, catch the Titans like the Alphas in Ar Arceus. Both people and, and Pokemon need to refuel sometimes. Comes back if you're low on energy. Okay. So how do I make it well, I have to find you first. I'm at the table. Oh! Okay, you can't do it at this table. You have to do it at your table or a friend's table. Not not an NPC's. Maybe there- I think there's just another one here. Hi, Rock Ruff! Hello! Hey, Doggo. They, the, in, in the towns, they sell the cloth claws to eat. But I mean, eating Pokemon has been around since the first time. Using water type moves? The first one I did. Yeah. I think terrestrializes. Should I use it? Uh. Yeah, I, it says push R. It's, it's, you can, but I think you'll have to talk to that guy next to us and, um, and rest again because you'll need to, well, or we might have to go to the Pokemon Center to read, to do your, um, Uh, yeah, Terra Orb again. Terra Orb. I'm kind of surprised at how much bigger the, uh... The Quaxley evolved form is bigger than the Florigato. But, oh man, that hairdo. <laughs> <laughs> and, and they're wearing a tiny, a tiny tank top. <laughs> yeah, I was standing right next to, to... The 
Rockruff seems to be enjoying the battle too. <laughs> fire type lion guy yeah uh, so. if if you're gonna learn takedown you gotta replace something like tackle well if you only have three moves then and Amber. okay um, I'd replace workup But it, uh, it means your next move will be stronger, but it's also, sometimes it feels like a waste of a move, because you're just waiting. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you were over here and now you're over there. Okay, talk to the picnic guy again and have a rest. Boss, do you have right now? Um, how do I look at that? Uh, you press X and then look in your bag. Because I'm gonna take you over to catch a gimme goal. Okay. Oh, it's the it's the little buggy Pokemon you caught before. I'm gonna catch it. Oh my gosh, it's a cricket! Well, I'm I'm focused on the cricket Pokemon, so. It does, that's the thing. I don't see you on my map. Maybe because I'm in a Pokemon battle. It has its third set of legs folded up. When it's in a tough spot, this Pokemon jumps over 30 feet using the strength of its legs. I was trying to name it, and I accidentally hit the B button one too many times. So nimble is just nimble. They had a name too. Away with you, nimble. Okay. Okay, go back. Go back to the table. Okay. It's different colors based on different parts of the world. So, but yeah, Black and White Pavilion is pretty striking. I remember seeing that when I battled her too. Oh, you 
vanished. I'm guessing you're. Oh, there you are. Hi. Okay, you ready to go catch the, uh, the gimme goal? Oh, yeah, heal up and come back over here. <laughs> For me, it's the. There's a Makuhita and a Claw. <laughs> So do you see Psyducks? Yeah, the cloth. <laughs> the cloth walked up on you. That's the Pokemon, so get ready. Oh no, I already caught it. I'm going to check. It is a ghost type. Oh, okay. Um. Caught it? Yes. Awesome! Now you have a gimme ghoul of your own and you can start collecting the coins. phone keeps catching me, so there's that. <laughs> I just fell down. You fell down too? That seems to be the only way to get down. Well, I had started climbing on the stairs. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's actually climbing, but I push the... Well, you heard the wrong Oh, okay. I see a terror raid over here. But also, uh, a Pokeball. Oh yeah, it's definitely yours, but it's a different color than the ones we've been seeing. Are you ready? Yeah. Go ahead and invite. Fighting type, which is weak to flying, psychic, and fairy. Oh my gosh, it's a fighting type Jigglypuff. Amazing. So you good to go? Uh, I'm I'm looking for a Pokemon. Okay. Sir Gallant. I need to get him a shining stone at some point, but so so look for uh, Quackers has a uh, flying type move, so you might just go with him. Okay. Yeah. 
already? Yeah, I'm already. So if you want to go with Quackers, or you want to find someone psychic or fairy. There we go. There's our NPCs. I've already caught a Jigglypuff, but it was... Oh, it was a Water-type Jigglypuff, which was super cool. It's a balloon Pokemon. Yes! And for the longest time, it was just a normal type. Well, since it's a fighting type, I will name her Usagi, which is the name of this Sailor Moon, yeah. So she's fighting rabbit, yeah. <laughs> Looks like there's two more on the... That's the Stony Cliff Titan. Yeah, okay. 